Calgary, two days after the death of a 49-year-old foreign national who had an altercation with two Canada Border Services Agency officers, Calgary police say they're not expecting to lay charges, we're not anticipating any charges to be laid based on the information we have right now, staff SGT. Colin Chisholm said Thursday, Calgary police staff SGT. Colin Chisholm says the man was 49 years old and that he died sometime between 3 p.m. and 4.30 p.m. On Tuesday, Evan Radford, Star Metro, Chisholm said the man, whose nationality he didn't reveal, was on KLM Airlines Flight 678 bound for Amsterdam. He was set to be deported out of Canada by the two CBSA officers on Tuesday afternoon. His identity hasn't been released because his next of kin have not been notified. At about 3 p.m., CPS airport unit members responded to an aircraft that had been returned to the gate after he had an altercation with two CBSA officers prior to takeoff, the staff sergeant said. Article continued below during the altercation, the 49-year-old went into medical distress and had to be taken to hospital, Chisholm explained. The man was declared dead by about 4.30 p.m. Chisholm said an autopsy is finished but he doesn't expect to know the cause of death or release details of the autopsy report for approximately six months. The incident is very unique, he said. We rarely come across an incident where we have an in-custody death that we investigate, especially on an airplane. The man was in Calgary for at least years but was not known to Paulus prior to the incident, Chisholm said. He also noted that, no weapon discharged, we have no information that a weapon was used. After the 49-year-old was taken to hospital, the plane took off for Amsterdam. That's forcing Calgary police investigators to try to contact witnesses who are no longer in the country, Chisholm said, we are in contact with the authorities in the Netherlands to assist us in carrying out those interviews, he said. Article continued Bellow he asked anyone who has information about the incident to contact the police service at 403-266-1234 to call Crime Stoppers. He added that the border services officers were also taken to hospital, where they were treated for minor injuries, they have since been released. With files from the Canadian press.